Hello everyone. Today I will introduce the biomass calculation features of LiDAR 360 to you. If you need to calculate the timber volume, mass, or even the mass of different organs of each tree in a forest, then this feature is exactly what you need. The basis for calculating biomass are individual tree attributes such as tree height, diameter at breast height, crown length, and biomass model. Firstly, you need to use a TLS or MLS LiDAR device to collect forest point cloud. After that, you can automatically classify vegetation, segment individual tree, and obtain the tree height, crown length, and DBH for each tree in LiDAR 360. We have related these tutorials on YouTube in Green Valley International's channel. You can search and follow the tutorials. Then, the outcomes, tree species, and the region where they grow. These are the factors you need to determine. For example, your sample plot is in Berkeley, the tree species is Ponderosa pine, and you want to calculate the above ground mass of them, it's a clear goal, and let's do it. Firstly, you can search for biomass in the toolbox to find the tree biomass estimation function. Double click it and input the individual tree attribute table, which can be obtained from the individual tree segmentation function. Then, you can choose the biomass database to use. Currently, we have the NBEL database effective in North America with 7,000 plus biomass model and a custom database. The usage of custom models will be introduced later. If you can provide the biomass model library of your region, we are glad to integrate it into LiDAR 360. After selecting the database, you need to choose the region as NW including Berkeley, the tree species as Ponderosa pine, and the desired result as above ground mass. After making the selections, click filter and you will see the corresponding formula. Then, select the model, click add to add it to the calculation list and click calculate to complete the biomass calculation. You can see that the above ground mass of each ponderosa pine has been calculated and saved in the CSV table as a new column of data. After the calculation is complete, you can open the CSV table to view the results. The added formulas can be exported and imported for direct calculation. Finally, we know that there are 428 trees in this area and the mass is 383,397.0751 kilograms totally. Of course, before we add the biomass model you need to the software, you can also customize biomass models. Open the Biomass Model Manager function, select Add Model, and enter the species name, click the plus sign, enter the regional information for the tree species, the type of result needed, choose a biomass model formula, and enter parameters. Of course, the specific form of the model is also customizable. You can double-click to add parameters such as DBH, height, and crown width to the model, and click OK. After adding the model, you can find your custom formula in the model database and use it for biomass calculation. Finally, if there are relevant databases or standards in your region, we are glad to add them to LiDAR 360 to help you calculate the biomass of each tree, such as timber volume, mass, or even the mass of different organs for each tree in a forest.